Breaking it, that's a lovely ball. Jay Boothroyd running down on the stone goal. He's just got Steve Banks in front of him and he's beaten him. 16 minutes played and Jay Boothroyd has given Coventry the lead. Jay Boothroyd again loves running at defenders. That's a great shot and it's 2 0 Coventry now after just 21 minutes. McAllister made plenty of changes to his side and it seems to be paying off dividends. Hoekstra with the ball. What's in a good ball? Evelyn was there. Cleared off the line by Barry Quinn. Can Stoke still get something out of this? It's a cool ball. But Hoekstra with a lovely delivery. And Iwalumu, lucky not to score there. Plenty of players standing around this. Hoekstra will strike it. It's got a deflection. And it's in the back of the net. Stoke City are back in this game. 32 minutes played. And it's 2-1. A well-worked goal. A great strike from the Dutchman. Caldwell whips it in. Dean Holter gets in front of his man. And it could have been 3-1 so easily. The ex-Wimbledon striker missing by millimetres there. Partridge and Wayne Thomas going for the ball. Partridge went down and Mr Hall is calling him over. And surely this is not a booking. That is a nothing challenge. And bearing in mind that Thomas has already been booked, he's now been sent off. And Mr Hall is ruining this game. It's a good ball. It's a way, but Gunnarsson's got in for it. And two commentary players have gone down. And Hall is calling for Al Cottage to get a physio to look at him. And Gunnarsson, it appears that he has been booked as well now. Stoke City are going to be down to nine men for the last five minutes, practically ruling any chance of them getting back into this game out. 